This video explains how to assign a legend to a product and how to create a new legend using the legends administration tool. In a map you can change the legend uh, in the product navigator tool of a product uh, by going to the product navigator uh, from the list of assigned uh, legends to uh, the sub product. So, so this is the list um, of the assigned legends to this particular product. And uh, you can assign a new legend uh, by clicking on the assign legend. There you see the list of available legends. You can go down to an NDVI. We are working with an NDVI. You can select one or two by holding the control button and then click on assign selected legends. And you will see that the two legends are now assigned to the product. You can choose one and apply it to the map. Let's say you want to change the color of a legend. For that you want uh, you need to go to the legend administration tool. There is in the upper left corner a menu. You click on it and you see then the item legends and you click on it and the legend administration tool will be opened from here you scroll down to the legend that you want to change so let's say we want to change this one Now, as you can see, you can only view the legend because it is defined by the JSC and not changeable. Um, so to make um, um, changes uh, to uh, this legend, you need to copy the legend. So you select the legend you want to copy. You click on the copy legend. And as you can see, a copy has been created, which now is editable. You click on the edit item and you can edit the legends. Here you can change all the properties of the legend. So let's say we want to change the color of this legend class you can then open the color picker and let's pick a very evident color like this one or a darker click on ok then we save the legend And now we can close the legend and assign it to the product. This one. We can now select the copied legend and add it to the map. In the legend administration tool, you can create a new legend by clicking on the new legend button. Here you have to uh, give um, the legend a descriptive name um, for example, uh, I will put um, 
my test legend and also a title uh, within the legend um, for example mdvi as you can see it will be shown in the preview then here you can create uh, new classes uh, by <coughs> clicking on the new class button so you can click multiple times and then you can uh, change uh, the values manually like this for example oh. yeah it sorts it by um, by the from field uh, and you can change uh, of course for each of them give I can give a color and you can of course also delete classes by clicking on the delete button like this or delete all the classes by clicking on the delete all button you can also generate um, a list of classes by clicking on this button um, for example you can uh, generate 100 classes you have to give it a start uh, value and an end value which is the physical value of the sub product and you can uh, define a start color and an end color in this case i've uh, chosen 100 classes start value 1 and value 100 uh, from red to blue and I will apply <coughs> a class label click on generate And you see that 100 classes are generated all over the label. <coughs> you can also see that the legend with all these labels is too big. So it is better to remove, oh, sorry, remove the labels. We are going to generate the labels again, delete all, but without the class labels. So now you can start to give a label yourself, but not for all the classes, for example, every tenth step etc you can also generate logarithmic values for <coughs> all the classes uh, that are currently uh, defined within the legend in this case 100 classes you click on the log x values button and here you have to uh, give um, a minimum I think that is the minimum for the logarithmic and then a maximum let's say one. Oh dear one and you click on generate and you see that a logarithmic value is assigned for each class from 0 to 1. When you are happy with your legend, you click on save. OK. And the legend is saved. 
and you close, it will appear in the Legend Administration too. Thank you for your attention.